Hi guys, over there is my closet. It's a junk pit right now. So I'm not gonna show anyone that. And I'm still trying to go over with the collage and stuff. I'm just gonna warn you that my walls are not the most perfect walls in the world. Um, this old room was my brother's and you know boys, they go all crazy and mess up stuff. So my walls are pretty junky. Up top I have my um, Victoria's Secret bag. I always put like a little decoration bag up there because it looks super cute and without it, it just looks butt naked. Over here is just my random little pink pup that I got. Oop, it's dirty. It's a random little pink pup that I got. Oh! <laughs> Redo. <laughs> okay, so up here is my random little pink pup that I got from Victoria's Secret. It's always chilling right there in the corner. It's a little lower, I have all my little lotions that I really like a lot. Um, my favorite out of all of them is obviously the lemon vanilla. I love the lemon vanilla. Okay, a little bit down, I made a DIY little hanging book show. I'm still waiting to buy some paint to paint this ugly part, but I will do a DIY later to show y'all how to make it because I think it's super cute. And on my bed, there's a cow on there, and this is the little baby that came with it. So I keep the little baby up here by herself, and I just let her chill. I don't know why I put her in that position. Okay, there we go. And then over here is another pink dog. As you can tell, I'm obsessed with Victoria's Secret. And I just showed you his butt. <laughs> and it has pink on one side and it has forever on one side. But I just keep it on the forever side like that. And this one like that. So it says love or well, forever love. So, you know. <laughs> so that's that shelf. I need to paint it. And after I'm done painting it, I will do like... A DIY for it right now I don't have the paint so I need to go to the store and paint a lot of stuff a little bit lower is the actual bookshelf so I made these out of refrigerator containers and I found them in the garage and I was like okay these aren't doing anything so I most of the time make up stuff so <laughs> I find something make it up so I made a bookshelf out of this because this is acrylic so the same stuff that the container store makes their containers out of that's what basically the bookshelf is made out of so over here is my camera that I got from my mother she didn't really use it and I was like okay can I use it for decoration and in the end she ended up giving it to me so I keep that there over here is my little cute heart bag that I got from Bath and Body Works And then a little bit lower, I'm going to go through the bolt. Over here is keeping the moon. Yeah. <laughs> and water break. So anyways, I really don't like that bolt by her. So um, I keep it anyways because it looks cute next to the other ones. And I didn't want to get rid of her bulk. I was like, okay, I might as well just have all of her bolts. So that's there. So anyways, um, my lips were getting chapped. So I was like, okay, I need to put on some chapstick or something because I noticed that whenever I'm recording I obviously talk more than I would usually talk because when you have a conversation you're going back and forth but when I'm talking to you guys <laughs> I'm talking to a camera or myself so yeah back to what I was saying after I got on that little random trail okay over here is that summer this was actually the first book that I read by Sarah and I instantly fell in love with her writing style and then over here is my favorite book by her someone like you it's a very cute and girly and then over here is this lullaby and then over here is just listen over here is a book by Elizabeth Scott between here and forever okay so over here here is my little favorite. I love this book so much. It's amazing. Just if you haven't read this book, you should go read it. And then over here is who is out of order. <laughs> I usually put her books in order, but yeah, it is out of order. Okay, we're gonna start over here, then go over, because I would go backwards if I started right here. So, over here is Delirium, my favorite, second favorite book from her. It was one of her best out of the whole entire um, 
series. I literally cried at the end of the book and uh, it was just an amazing book. This cover is actually way better than the other one. And then, oh, be like, okay, that just fell anyways. Pandemonium, and then the third, and not so good, is Reculum. Whatever, just correct me in the comments, because <laughs> I know you will. <laughs> Moving on, this book I had a problem with. I still haven't finished it. I only bought it because it was on TV and I was like, okay, let me read the book first before I watch the show. And in the end, the book was horrible and I think the show got canceled. So I'm not even gonna talk about that. <laughs> Over here is Long for the Bride. I've been reading this and I read the whole thing and I really liked it. This is my, I think, third favorite from Sarah. And I really like it. And then over here is Peace, Love, and Baby Ducks, which is a really weird title, but I really enjoy this book. This is actually a good book, and it's a really dirty cover because I bought it off of eBay, and it's ripped. <laughs> Oops. But anyways, I, I really like this book. Okay, down here, my back is hurting because I was like on my knees, and yeah. Down here, I have tissues that I save and stuff like that for DIY projects. This container I made myself, as you can probably tell. And over here, I have uh, my workout thing, Turbo Jam. That uh, another thing that I got from my mother. She didn't use it anymore, and she never really uses it. <laughs> she buys a whole bunch of stuff and doesn't use it, so. I end up using a lot of her stuff. And now all of these are all of my Seventeen magazines. I started subscribing to Seventeen in 2010 and it goes all the way to now. Okay, so down here is The Sims 3. I have more than this, but I just put these right here and my other ones are with my sister. So I wanted to put the pink one on the bottom because it would just look really cute with this bag. And I was like, okay, what am I going to put in here? So I put the Twilight Little Breaking Dawn Part 1. And then I have 27 dresses. I just bought this because I saw it on sale. I was like, okay, why not? And then right here I have A Walk to Remember, which is my favorite movie. And then down here is my favorite book that I've been loving ever since I was little. I think I read this uh, when I was 13 years old. And then over here is all my Cosmos or whatever. Oh my goodness. I don't know if y'all can hear my mom in the background. I'm going to re-record this. <laughs> so that is all of my books. I hope you enjoyed. And um, if you liked it, remember to give it a thumbs up. And if you have any comments or suggestions, just tell me inside of the comment section below, which sounds really weird. <laughs> okay, I'll see you next time. Bye. Why am I talking so weird? I promise I don't talk like this. Um, yeah. I really like that. Yeah. I really like that book, Enunciate. And yeah, the joys of being dyslexic. Give me some of that. Yeah. Give me some of that. Give me some of that.